Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try a meal recommended to me by Brandon, so thank you Brandon. This is the Banquet uh, Chicken Strips meal, and I did open the end just so I could get to it easier. Um, I think I've been it out right now. Um, it is breaded chicken breast strip patties with rib meat, macaroni and cheese sauce, and sweet corn. It looks really good. The patties could be, I don't know, we'll see. Um, let's see, 440 calories, which is a little over what I normally do. Um, I may I may cut out half a strip or something. We'll see. Um, sodium, wow, almost half your daily sodium in one meal. That's a lot. Um, I'm used to eating lots of salt, though it seems. So we're going to remove the film from the meal completely. Huh, okay, so we're going to remove the film from the meal. Remove the chicken strips. Microwave it for one minute. Stir the macaroni and cheese. Put the chicken back in and then microwave for an additional two to three minutes. So, remove all the plastic, which that's weird. That's, I've never seen that very often. Um, remove the chicken in minute, one minute to look at. So here's the meal. Um, chicken strips actually look pretty good. I guess they would get hard and dry if you did them the whole time. But um, that's the rest of the meal. So it looks like you get quite a bit of food in this uh, for 440 calories. So let me uh, get this in the microwave and I'll be back. Okay, here's the meal out of the microwave. I wanted to flip these over to see if they got moist in the bottom. No, they're not too bad. They didn't stay in there very long. I only put it in two and a half minutes after the first minute. So, corn looks good. Macaroni looks pretty good. So I'm gonna stir this all up, let it cool off, and I'll be back. Okay, it's had some time to cool off, so I'm screwed over here. Um, just, I'm gonna try macaroni first. Hmm. I always do like Banquet's macaroni. Um, it tastes very artificial. I mean, there's nothing, it doesn't taste real at all. I like it because the pasta is always good and firm. Um, it's not overly cooked, it's not smushy or wooshy, mashed or anything like that. Um, corn should be pretty straightforward. Mm. It's actually really good corn. Um, some microwavable corn gets really um, hard and dried up. This one has plenty of moisture in it. It's good and tender. The um, the skin of the corn, whatever you call it, um, is a little tough. It's not bad, but it's just a just a touch tough. So it, it's not like I said, it's not bad. It's just it's just a little tough. And I'm just gonna take a chicken finger and just eat it. Hmm. It's actually really good. The um, got a good seasoning to it. It's got a um, a grainy breading like a, a cornmeal or something like that like a it's breaded instead of battered um, it's pretty good it's it's like I said it's got a good seasoning to it it's not spicy by any means but it's um, it's got a bit of a seasoning to it it's got a crispiness to it so if you um, if you wanted to uh, do this in the oven you could probably yeah you could do it in the oven, but but um, it's pretty plenty crisp enough as it is. I think the breading, the the graininess, that cornbready kind of texture um, really helps a lot. Yeah, overall this is an excellent meal. Um, it's really good. The calories are a little high for me, but um, but it's definitely worth trying out if you don't mind the calories. Um, I'm gonna give this one a four. It's not something I would eat like every week or anything, but it's definitely a meal you should try out if you if you like uh, chicken fingers and um, like them little crispy then, then you'll like this so um hope you enjoyed the video if you did please leave me a like and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and i'll catch you next time